Well, I'm back. I just took you on that tour of the mine and uh, it's kind of interesting, but I'm not sure if I showed you how I got there, so <laughs> I'll show you. Here's the road. It's kind of interesting. It's just, I went, uh, I gotta plug one thing in here and then I'll be set. Keep my battery from running out. Okay, yeah, uh, I just went by Google Maps, it showed it. And there is actually no developed road to see it, so, but I found one. But I went down this road here looking and Google actually took me down that road and then they told me to go into the woods there. <laughs> There's no road or nothing. But here's what it looks like to get to get there. Uh, these are old roads, I don't know. Might have been the highway or something. But way down there by those pine trees is where I parked. I won't go all the way back, but, but it was kind of interesting. <laughs> if you happen to be in the area, I wanted to make sure you knew how to get there. And I could go to uh, Google Maps to show you too where I'm at. And then I gotta get I gotta get to the campground. I got one more stop for, uh, let's see. Oh, I picked up the firewood. Oh, one more stop for uh, a Subway sandwich. And then I'll be there. So hopefully here we, I can cross this uh, four lane. I think I can. I hope I don't have uh, iron colored tires when I get through this adventure. <laughs> yeah, I can cross right here, this is good. There's another turn off over there, but I wouldn't have been able to cross the freeway. Okay, I think I can cross here. Might as well, there's nobody doing anything else. Okay. Heavy traffic. So here's my sign now. I was gonna say the sign. I think I'm gonna take Highway 5, not 73. Is the route that I should get on. So there's the mine right there. Kind of a nice little adventure. I, you know, I've driven past this particular mine, in fact, quite a few times, but never really looked very hard. But up at it's called the Discovery Center and uh, it's got a view of another mine I believe so I got a view without even having to pay <laughs> well <clears throat> yeah a sub sandwich for a foot long for tonight for dinner and I got firewood for a fire and the weather looks good I got some nuts I was looking for peanuts maybe I'll grab some peanuts when I get that so well they wouldn't have peanuts but here's highway 5 st. Louis County 5 and this is my turn off uh, I think if it might be I'm gonna go on another tour <laughs> no this is it you can see this a monument up here to miners. It's kind of neat. It's a big statue. Uh, well that must be... Yeah, that's part of the Discovery Center. But... I, I'll save that for another day. I, I think I've been there once. There's the guy up there. Oh, there's McDonald's. I'll grab a McDonald's right now. I'm pretty hungry, and then uh, I'll come back for, uh, and I'll get the uh, sub sandwich for tonight. Well, that'll work out good. In fact, that's what I was thinking about doing. All right, I'll show you the stamp, this uh, statue first. It's pretty neat. It's called Iron Man. Oops. 
That's a pretty good sized Iron Man there. Yeah. The Iron Man Miner's Memorial. So I guess well, that depicts, uh, I don't know if they used to haul them out in kind of a train type trolley or something. I don't understand it. I'd have to go up there to look. But look at that old uh, pickup truck here. That's a, a Chevy. It's pretty good. 65 Chevy pickup. It looks in excellent shape for for being restored. <clears throat> well, so a little meter type hot rod. So I'll, uh, I'll get back to you. I'm going to go through the drive through and get something good to eat. Maybe nothing too much because I'm going to grab that sub too. But uh, we'll talk to you later. Bye.